everyone and welcome, welcome to live. I hope everyone's having a fabulous day. It is so darn cold in Minneapolis. This is one of those days where I say we earn our reputation. It is a full on 16 below zero today. So there is nothing I can think of more that I want to talk about the number one, first of all, being in this cozy, cozy studio, but talking about some really cute, fun tops that'll get me through and maybe bring a little sunshine to an otherwise kind of gray and frankly frigid day. I hope someone out there is having warmer weather than us because man, this is brutal. It's one of those days where you like back out, for those of you who don't live in a cold climate, you back out of your garage and it makes this horrendous sound like the earth is cracking open because it is so cold. So we're just gonna hunker down, we're gonna do a little life. So here's the deal. So many fun tops and this time of year we're always looking for ways to infuse some newness into our wardrobe. A top is the easiest way to do it. I've got some great tees, some fun sweatshirts, great button downs, and I'm gonna highlight some of our favorite good American new denim that just came in. So let's start with this. Now to me, this is kind of a clean slate, fresh palette, started off right kind of uniform. I grab a fabulous white shirt, pair it back to a great pair of denim and a great kick, and I am done and done. Frankly, this is my uniform year round, but when in doubt during the new year, this is what I lean into. So let's start with this great top. This is from Cloth and Stone. Now, one of the reasons I absolutely adore this shirt, it's gauze and it's a little bit shorter. So for those of you who have adopted and are embracing that higher rise in denim and you like to do a full top to get credit for that waist, this is a fabulous top to wear because it is so easy to tuck in. It's not super long. Now I'm pairing it back to that 90s fit. And for those of you who graduated or have some fond memories of those 90s, let me tell you, this jean takes the best and forgets the rest. So here's the deal. Higher rise, more room through the hip and thigh and a straight leg, and here's the clincher with the 90s, a fuller length. So for you long-legged mamas, for those of you who like a full-length denim, or frankly, those of you who live in a climate like I do and it is frigid, this is a fabulous silhouette to pop on because you get that coverage. Now, easy, easy, right? Pair it back to a pair of kicks. Now, I grabbed these from P448. One of the many, many reasons I love these is that they are such a clean shoe. Solid white with just this little hit of kind of a black faux crock on the back. Crazy, crazy comfortable. Go with anything. And if you're maybe planning a trip in the future, I don't know about you, I always bring a pair of kicks with me on a trip. This is an easy one to wear in the airport. Slip on, slip off. Throw it in your bag. Throw it on with a little in a dress. Good to go. So. If we stay on this fun kind of button down trend, I've got a couple more great ones to show you from Sundry So Great. Okay, let's start with this guy. So Poplin, what I think is so fun about this is that it takes kind of that clean button down silhouette and adds some fun feminine detail, but not over the top. So you get this really fun little stripe here, which I think is so darn cute a little bit fuller sleeve and gathering at the wrist, but it's not elastic. So you're still gonna get that button closure. Easy, easy body. This looks great with a pair of denim tucked in. I also absolutely love this with a pair of cutoffs. This would be a great vacay top. Another one, and this is great, this is an exclusive only at Every, is this fabulous top from Sundry. I mean, a blue and white stripe. You can't go wrong here. It's so easy to wear. Love this guy, but here's the secret sauce. Here's what makes it so special. Ah, neon stripe on the side. How fun is that? Adds a little bit of novelty to the shirt, and this guy is longer. So, how to wear this? Couple different thoughts. I have on that great Z Supply. I feel like I'm, yeah, well, I am. So, that I, I, feel like I was going to say I feel like I'm undressing, but I am. So, I have on that great Z Supply rib tank underneath this shirt. Wear it with this, leave this guy open, pop on a pair of cutoffs, done and done. Wear this with a pair of denim now, so fantastic. One of the things I absolutely adore about a tunic length shirt, or just a shirt with a little more length, especially for trips, this is a great one to wear as your cover up. 
Don't overpack. You don't need a fancy special cover up. This guy can totally do the trick. It's light and breezy and easy. It'll keep the sun off of your arms when you've just had enough. Long enough to cover the tush. Really easy to pop on. So darn cute, so fresh. To and from the beach, love this guy. Now, another version of kind of the shirt I'm wearing. This is gauze. Wanted to show you this beautiful drapey fabric. This is an every style, so fun. Also comes in black note. This guy is kind of your white shirt chameleon. So, runs a little longer. Wear this with leggings if you're doing that now, or a great pair of joggers, and then a longer coat. Chic, easy, done. Pair it with a pair of jeans, unbutton it a little bit, stack up your necklaces, throw on a pair of hoops and a heel, dinner out. Pop it on with a great jean, a little sneak, baby hoops like I've got on now, out the door, your weekend uniform. Can't go wrong with a white shirt, always on a quest to find the perfect one. If you don't like a lot of kind of rigidity feeling in a shirt, this guy has all the great drape to it, one of my absolute favorites. I do think this guy runs a little generous, not so much that I would go down a size, but just note that it's a little bit more of a relaxed silhouette. So if you want something to feel a little more tailored, I would go down a size for that reason. And last but not least, there's that fun denim category. So had to show this guy from Free People. This has been one of my favorites. I'm just gonna put it on because it's so darn cute. Everybody needs a denim shirt, right? We've all got one in our closet. We've worn it. We popped the collar. We did all the things with it. It was a staple forever. I still have mine, I still love it. I rock that puppy all the time. It's like my kind of my go-to extra layer if I wanna pop something on underneath a sweater. But I think it's really fun to look for a great statement blouse in denim. It stays casual, it's not too overdone, but it still feels really cool and fresh. And yes, you can do denim on denim. I know you're gonna ask, so I'm just gonna tell you, you can do it. Right? Everyone's like, I know, can you do it? Can you do denim on denim? I mean, I'm gonna be real honest here. I have not ever let go of that trend. I love denim on denim. It's been kind of a staple uniform for me forever. Okay, so here's the deal. Free, free people, you know free people, right? They run generous. It is just what they do. I kind of like it. I don't know. It's kind of fun to be able to size down and everything that they give you. But in this guy in particular, I like this better tucked in. So this is like one of the benefits of doing live, right? It's like I can treat you guys like my camera. I can see myself in it. Okay, so and then I'm just gonna do a little quick tuck in the back. I love all the unique details. I know, this is what makes it so fun. So it's not your standard kind of like typical button down in denim, right? You've got all this fun detail. So a little bit of that kind of Western bib detailing here. Really fun ruffle on the sleeve. I also love that this guy isn't a full length sleeve. So more of a three quarter, it's gathered so you can kind of play with it. Keep it nice and open, so easy, so fun to wear. Pretty darn cute, right? Absolutely one of our favorites that came in. And again, it's generous. So this is a small. I'd probably go down to an extra small on this guy just to give myself a little bit less width in the body. Now, if I wanted to kind of, like I'm wearing these great 90s jeans. I think they're really fun. This feels a little forward, right? It's fun to wear this silhouette. I think it balances out the super fem feminine kind of feel of the top and you go back to this more sporty jean. If I wanted to kind of sex this up a little bit, you know what I would do? I'd pop on a flare. Flare's game. They're having a moment. And for those of you who loved them when they were around last time, I'm gonna remind you why they are such a home run. They make your legs look a million miles long. They're crazy comfortable, super flattering because they give you that great balance from your hips and thighs, and they're comfortable. Okay, so this is from Good American. This is the Good Curve Straight. Really fun one here. We also have, I want to grab a couple more. What's this guy? This is a similar fit to what I'm wearing now, that Good 90s Icon. So both of these, more of a full length. I would pop on a heel with either one of these and put them on with this shirt and it feels like a little bit more of a going out outfit. Otherwise, this is just your straight up Wear it all the time, uniform on the weekends, done and done. What socks would you wear with those sneakers? I would just wear a no-show. 
that's, that's kind of what I slip on. So some of my favorite no-shows are from Bombas. I also think if you live in a little bit chillier climate, um, that, um, gosh, what are some of the great ones that I have? Smart Wool makes a really good no-show sock. So kind of two of my faves that just kind of disappear underneath your shoes. So sometimes I just go barefoot and I'm feeling lazy, even though I like tell my daughter she can't do that and I do it, but that's kind of how I rock it. Okay, in the same vein, it's so fun. Thinking about those of you who live in a little bit warmer climate and or are heading somewhere sunny, another great top. This is also from Free People, but check this puppy out. Here is what is so fun about this guy. It is a knit. So it's like your favorite t-shirt, done fashion. So cute. So you've got this great washed down blue version, looks like denim, feels like your favorite tee, or this beautiful, beautiful white. Now what I think is so fun about both of these, they are dress up, dress down, right? You can see it, you could knock around in these in a little cutoff or your favorite pair of jeans, or pair these back to, you know, something maybe a little bit more elevated, a sleeker, cleaner bottom. Pair it with a little wedge sandal and you've got a fun night outlook for your vacation. So darn cute. There's just a few people that are not sure about the denim on denim, but I <laughs> No, I totally get it. I, here's what I think. First of all, there's no rules, right? So we are past the point where I'm going to tell you you can do this or you can't do that. I'm just going to tell you you do you. I love denim on denim. I don't think it's for everyone and I think that's okay. Like if, that's, if you don't feel good in it, then don't wear it. That it should always be your number one rule. If you are curious about trying denim on denim, here are my suggestions. I like to go, I like to break up my washes so I don't feel too same, same top and bottom, or I go uber, uber clean. So if my washes are similar, then I wanna keep them really dark. So I'll go with like a dark wash, clean top, dark wash, high rise, slim jean. Chic, sexy, easy. And you know who I always think about whenever I think about denim on denim and whether I like it? J-Lo. She, there is like this iconic picture of her where she's wearing a denim shirt and skinny jeans and a pair of heels and she looks like a freaking rock star. So whenever I want to channel my J-Lo vibes, because you know, we all need a little J-Lo in our life sometimes, I think of that image and I go for it, right? Yeah. So fun. Could you talk about the sundry shirt again and the sizing and material? Yes. So, okay, with both? Um, yes. Both. Okay. So sundry, sizes 0, 1, 2, 3. Tricky, right? Confusing, like, what am I, what am I? 0, extra small, 1, small, etc., etc. So how do both of these guys run? I would say that the stripe, a little bit generous, more of a relaxed silhouette. I wore a 1 in this when I popped it on as a small. And it felt the way I wanted it to feel, which was easy, breezy, light. If you want it to look a little bit more tailored, I will go down a size. This guy, similar, although there's a little bit, I'd say more shape to this one, but it's got a wider body and a drop sleeve. So this too, if you want it to feel a little bit more tailored, you can go down a size in this one, but I went with my normal size because I think it's meant to feel kind of light, resorty, vacation, getaway. Great question. Okay, so we talked about those fun free people tops. Let's talk knits. So many great fashion tees this time of year. I've got a couple favorites I want to flash. Guess what? They're from Sundry. You know, they just do it so well. So starting with this fabulous little puff sleeve with a ruffle around the neck, two colors. First color, this yummy, yummy coral. Second in this yummy, yummy navy. One of the reasons I love this guy is because it's lightweight, it's got a straight sleeve, so if you don't like that gathering around your arm, this is a nice way to do it, really clean. Little bit of gathering here, straight body. So this is an easy one to do a half tuck if you don't want to do a full tuck. And adds a little bit of pop of color to your closet. If you're more classic, you want something that's just really neutral and easy, this navy is a great way to go. Okay, another fun sundry top two colors in this one as well. Now this guy is great because it definitely can dress up a little bit more. So gathered neckline, fun gathered sleeve, straight body. This is also a fantastic top if you are a little bit curvier on top because you can leave it untucked. Now this yummy pink Valentine's Day coming at ya. I see this one, I think it'd be so fun. 
or of course a great white. So if you are not a button down gal, if you don't love a woven shirt, let this be your go-to white shirt. Easy one to dress up, that nice open neckline allows you to put on a great little necklace or a pair of hoops. Tuck this guy into a pair of jeans, done and done. Now, one of the things about this top I think is that it can go a little sweet. So to counteract that, I look for a jean with a little bit of destruction. So this fabulous jean, this is the Good Leg Cigarette. This is a fabulous jean, so slimming on the legs, so comfortable. Love the destruction here. And so this guy paired back with a sweeter top, I think takes a little bit of that saccharin out of it, makes it a little more edgy, a little bit less expected. I think if you went really clean with this guy, it's going to go a little bit more preppy. Let's keep it a little bit more sexy. Okay, other fun tops that I want to talk about. Oh, playing favorites, playing favorites. Okay, let's take the sexy bank because this one's so darn cute. And I'm actually gonna put this on so you guys can see. This is from Z Supply, a really fun neckline on this one. More of a square neck. So that's definitely a trend we've been seeing out there. Really cute, really flattering. It's a fun little date night knit. So an easy one to wear if you're going out for the night but want to stay really comfortable. And if you're just kind of over your sweater weather, I mean, I get it. We've been wearing our sweaters like crazy. And even on a frigid day like today, sometimes it's nice just to have something other than a sweater on. So Z Supply, I'm gonna tell you the name of this one. This is the Willow Long Sleeve Rib Top. It's got this great detail on the sleeve, which is so darn fun. But the neckline is really what makes this look cute. And it's not gonna look good with this tank. So you're gonna have to Let's see if I can work my magic and make it disappear underneath here. A little bit I can. Okay, so let's get that tank tucked away so you guys can get a better idea. Okay, so that neckline, so darn pretty, right? Square neckline, really, really flattering on so many body types. This guy is more shaped through the body. This is one I would say either wear it with a pair of clean jeans and leave it out or Tuck this guy in, so fun, so cute. You could knock around this obviously super easily with your sneakers on, but I also love the idea of popping this on with a fun little heel for date night or a booty, good and out the door. Okay, we're gonna keep on that like date night train because there's another really fun top that is so darn cute that's out there in the world. Kind of almost, dare say, sweatshirt. Kind of bordering on a sweatshirt, I would say. And that is this top from Eve. So this guy is called the Page Draped Rib Top. Similar open neckline. So if you don't want the fitted silhouette of that Z Supply black top, but you like the idea of having more of an open neckline, this is a really great way to go. You also are going to get that great banding at the bottom. So no worrying about tucking or not tucking. It's just going to fall beautifully for you and a drop shoulder, so this is a really easy one. You're not gonna feel super tight on your arms. Similar idea, this one's so darn cute. I'm gonna pop this guy on. This is from LNA. This is one of those, is it a t-shirt, is it a sweatshirt? Maybe it's a little bit of both. What it is is dreamy, cozy, and comfortable in this yummy vanilla color. So I love this guy because to me, this feels like a sweatshirt like with the like volume turned up a little bit. So super cute, little cutouts here, banded bottom, which I think is so easy. Love that it has, check this out on the sleeve. How fun is that, you guys? Little cutouts on the sleeve, starting up here, but in this cutout silhouette, you can still wear your normal bra. So how to style this guy? Well, I got on my white sneaks, maybe to kind of mix it up a little bit and go a little creamier. I think I might do this actually. So new sneaker brand for us, really, really fun. Comes in all these great neutrals. We've got a couple different silhouettes on mine. I like this guy because it's got that trainer vibe to it. And with that hit of kind of a camel, cream, taupe, and black, so easy, right? Still looks sporty, but really fun. So I'm envisioning, and maybe it's because it's got on my mind, I've got a little hockey tournament coming up in the next couple weeks and the parents always like to go out and grab dinner. I think this would be a super fun top to wear back to a pair of denim, and then my kicks, good and out the door. So fun. Couple sweatshirts that are absolutely 
flying out of here that you've got to see, starting with this great striped Henley. Such a great one. This is from Rowan and Ryan, $78. We are almost out of this guy, but I had to show it one more time because it's such a home run. Love that it's a Henley, so control that neckline, open it up, let it down. In black and white, another great palette cleanser, a fun one to wear for spring or the oncoming spring season. Unexpected, craving a white sweatshirt. This is a really fun one to do. Asymmetrical neckline with a zipper, so you can let this guy open up or zip it all the way up and it acts as a turtleneck. Lightweight in white, banded bottom, and it has pockets, so dreamy. Absolutely love this guy, and I think what's really nice about this, the Rowan and Ryan, this guy, and then the sweatshirt I'm gonna show you next, is that none of them are super long. So they're really, really easy to pair back to your higher waist denim. They're not gonna feel overwhelming. You're not gonna drown in them. Really fun one. Get this one while you can, because it's going fast, fast, fast. And then last but not least, this has been our best selling sweatshirt because it is a ray of sunshine right now. Michael Stars, check out this great rainbow stripe running down the side in navy so yummy so fun absolutely adore this guy very similar to the sweatshirt i have on and that it's not heavy a nice lightweight i would say this would also be a great one to take on a vacation maybe you need to throw a little something in your bag for those chillier beach nights or for the plane this is a great one to have adore this so so fun okay i think we've covered the gamut We've talked about all these great tops. You can just pop in your closet, get a little shot of energy, whether it's for knocking around on the weekends, dressing up a little bit for date night, or just your daily uniform needs a little jolt. Get those kicks. Great new jeans from Good American, and you are ready to go out the door. Hope this gave you some good ideas, gang. Stay warm, everyone. And for those of you that are already warm, consider me jealous. See you soon.